Well, Lotus has just entered the Indian market with this, the Elite Ray Electric Hyper SUV. And I'm going to give you a quick walk around, around this Hyper SUV and tell you all about it. Taking a look at the Lotus Elite Ray, just look at the sharp creases and design cues around this electric SUV. That part that you see on the top and right down there are the LiDAR based ADAS systems that the Elite Ray comes with. Then of course on the side you have the 22 inch alloy wheels with carbon fiber elements and wrapped in Pirelli wheels. Then of course you see the unit for the 360 degree camera down there and here's a wider look at what this SUV looks like from the side angle. Now, as you can see, this is a very flowing design and flowing shape, which of course gives this electric SUV a very low drag coefficient. And here is what it looks like from the back. Now that is of course an active aero wing and the whole look at the back, which includes that LiDAR unit and these fin type elements looks really cool and unique. In terms of performance specs, the Elite Ray gets 905 horsepower and 985 newton meters of torque capability which catapults this electric suv from a 0 to 100 in just under three seconds now that is seriously quick for an suv which weighs up to 2.5 tons coming back to the front of the elite ray you can see the very nice lotus badge right up there then this is actually its drl and uh, gets very intricate work inside and the actual LED headlamps are down here then of course you also get a carbon fiber element right down here the contrast between the body color and the blacked out roof along with these elements look really nice and upmarket especially the hood itself which gets these really deep scoops and makes the car look like it's going fast even if it's standing still right there in front of us all right so now i'm taking you inside the elite ray suv to show you what kind of a cabin lotus has given this electric suv and just look at this this is completely unique and looks so futuristic there is no big screen right up there but of course there is a very big infotainment touch screen right here in the middle and the driver information is given through this very sleek digital display that we can see here then of course you have this steering wheel which is uh, pretty unique in itself i mean i don't know what to call this shape maybe it's hexagonal or something else you let us know then you have these airplane style toggles here as well of course the regen is here in a paddle shifter style and you also get the drive mode selector here as well then of course the rest of the interior is finished in the same space gray dark gray and with these yellow stitchings and this is what the front seats look like and those are the rare seats of the Elite Ray. Of course there is a panoramic sunroof here up front but I do not think that this one opens up and let's check out here yeah so this is you could call it a moonroof basically and of course the Elite Ray also gets a 23 speaker audio system and apart from that you also get a wireless charger here there is a quite good amount of space down here as well so that was the elite ray hyper suv let us know what you thought about this in the comment section below like always do remember to like share and subscribe to our channel for more such content until next time this is Amber Banerjee signing out